Good morning, Charlie. So we had some uh, interesting moves in the FX market in the, the Northern Hemisphere session. The US dollar rallied modestly uh, into month end with the dollar index pushing to the top of its recent range to again test that big 102 level, uh, which has been pretty stiff resistance lately. The data highlight out of the US is the Chicago PMI figure, which rose from the previous figure but did miss expectations. Uh, Fed speak, we had Governor Goldsby I added little new from the FOMC statement last week, but uh, saying not sure when the Fed will be done raising rates, uh, making good progress on inflation, data dependent, et cetera, et cetera. They may or may not hike in September uh, as far as he's concerned. Euro was uh, weighed on by a dollar strength. Uh, Euro US dipping below that uh, key psychological 110 level early in the session for found a bit of support at its lower trend line there. Bounce on hot inflation and strong GDP out of the Eurozone saw Euro US reclaim that 110 level, but it's a bit unconvincing, but so far it's holding it. Uh, currently markets are pricing in around a 25 to 30% chance of a hike in the ECB September meeting. So with the ECB being data dependent, um, any news regarding inflation, especially from the EU, should see a pretty big impact on the euro. Uh, Japanese yen was markedly weaker to start the week, um, following on from last week's BOJ meeting. During the uh, Asian session, the BOJ did offer to buy an unlimited amount of JGBs uh, in an unscheduled announcement in an effort to defend their new flexible uh, yield control limits. Um, it's a bit of a feeling of panic at the Japanese central bank, and that, that saw selling in the in the uh, in the yen, uh, US dollar yen heading above 142. I think it's pretty likely to test that intervention zone at 145. The way things are looking as well in the near future. Uh, Aussie and Kiwi were the outperformers, and Aussie, the Aussie especially, was a clear winner. Uh, more talk from China regarding uh, future stimulus. Aussie US rose above and held that big figure at 67 US cents. Aussie dollar traders also positioning for the RBA policy announcement today due at 11.30 Australian Eastern Standard Time. Uh, markets are currently split, the rates markets anyway, uh, it's a, between a hike or a hold following those cooler than expected Aussie CPI figures last week. Um, futures are showing 15 and a bit percent chance of a hike, but uh, economists that have been polled are, are calling it much closer than that. So, Certainly could be an exciting meeting.